I'm Brittany McGraw and this is your 10 news update. It's been a Thanksgiving unlike any other due to COVID-19. On Thursday, the Commonwealth reported 2600 new cases, bringing the total to just under 230,000. One local tradition, the Roanoke Rescue Missions Feast, looks very different this year. From a savory turkey dinner to a slice of pie, the Rescue Mission served 400 meals to those in need, both indoors and outside. Events like the drumstick dash helped make the feast possible. This year, the 5K had to go virtual, but that didn't stop one woman from Buchanan from pursuing her dream. After recovering from cancer, Kelly Berry has taken part in the dash in a wheelchair or using a cane, but this year is the first year that she ran it without any help. Meanwhile, over in Lynchburg, the city's annual turkey trot also went virtual, but that didn't stop runners from keeping the tradition alive. Instead of gathering by the thousands, 1,400 participants ran on their own time. Due to the pandemic, it seems many people are getting a head start on holiday decorations. The owner of Sweet Providence Christmas Tree Farm in Floyd County says typically they sell a couple dozen trees opening weekend. This year, they sold about 200. A reminder that you can get updates on the go with WSLS.com and the 10 News app. I'm Brittany McGraw, 10 News, working for you.